So I've um, received a message via um, social media asking me if I'm going to do any things like, um, you know, get your body summer ready, bikini ready or little black dress shreds and all this kind of stuff. Um, and I don't do those. And the reason that I don't do those is because I think they just really uh, perpetuate this kind of unhealthy, physically and unhealth, uh, mentally unhealthy attitude that um, quite a lot of people seem to have towards kind of uh, exercise and eating well. And it's sort of looked at as something that you just do to make your body look a certain way for a certain um, period of time, which I don't agree with. Um, so I see a lot of people that this might apply to you, might not, but I see a lot of people who I would say probably about eight to nine months of the year, they're kind of, they're down here. So they're um, not exercising or not exercising kind of consistently or regularly. They know, they tell me that they're not eating well, they know they're not, um, and they feel pretty crap about it. So physically they don't feel good and mentally they don't feel good because the physical and mental health go hand in hand. So we'll say this about eight to nine months of the year. And then you've got the other three to four months of the year up here. These people are up here because they've going on holiday they've got an event it's coming up for christmas um and so they go completely to the opposite end of the spectrum they take up some you know shred thing they're doing loads of exercise that they haven't been doing before they've gone on some extreme cutting their calories cutting their carbs um keto whatever some just extreme diet thing um to get ready for this you know event and mentally and physically they're not happy either they're not physically um well a lot of the time because they're really stressing their bodies they're not fueling themselves properly and they're not mentally happy because they're stressed and anxious so we've got eight or nine months of the year down here miserable not physically great not mentally great uh, the other three or four months of the year up here miserable not physically great not mentally great so it's just this horrible up and down up and down cycle um which I, I don't agree with and it's not something that I like to perpetuate. So what I'm saying is be here in the middle. So find exercise that you enjoy, um, you know, something you can do a couple of times a, a week. Don't focus on how many calories it burns you or whether someone says it's the best thing for building a massive ass. Um, concentrate on how it makes you feel. And once you've done it, how do you feel mentally? How do you feel physically? And then also concentrate on eating well most of the time now eating well doesn't mean eating salads or cutting your carbs or anything like this it means eating food that provides all the nutrients your body needs so food that has protein and carbohydrates and fat portion sizes that are appropriate for your body um, and your activity level so and if you do those things if you live here in the middle you're not going to have to worry about a summer shred or a christmas post christmas shred because you're going to be physically and mentally happy. You're going to be happy with the way you feel. You're going to be happy with the way you look. You can stick your bikini on and go to the co-op if you want to because you're going to feel that good. So, um, yeah, live here. Don't live down here. Don't live up here in the middle. Forget the bikini shreds and all that stuff.